to the morning routine. Good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're getting into my 7 a.m. morning routine. I've been waking up early. Usually the first thing I'll do, of course, is go on my phone. Then I love trapping my cat and forcing him to cuddle with me because he just gives me that boost of serotonin that I need in the mornings. This is your reminder to drink your water. then get into my morning skincare i'll brush my teeth wash my face i've been switching in between cleansers every morning recently i've been obsessed with the road facial cleanser my favorite way to start the mornings is by icing my face this thing just does such a good job at waking me up to puffing my face i got the eye patches on i finished doing the skincare and if i had to describe my routine every morning to you it would literally be skincare matcha and pilates those are my vibes every morning literally the perfect way to start the day i'm about to make some matcha and let me show you how i actually make my matcha every morning this is the matcha i've been using so i'll usually just take a little bit of this i'll usually use one of these to get rid of any clumps in the matcha I will dump in some hot water. I was gonna heat up some water and I'm so excited because I've been dying to unbox this. This came in the mail like yesterday. I'm gonna be using this every morning from now on when I make my matcha and my teas. I've wanted this for the longest time. It's been on my wish list for years now. Look at how cute. This is the iconic Smeg kettle. I got the mini version. I feel like such a mom now always getting excited about kitchen appliances. It is strawberry matcha season. I've been dying to try making my own strawberry matcha at home. I basically just cut up some strawberries and you're supposed to mash them up. Um, hello. I thought this was gonna turn out like a cute strawberry matcha color, but it just came out green and the strawberries are in there I just don't think I mushed them well. So good though Look at how delicious my matcha looks I just laid out my workout outfit. I'm gonna go to a Pilates class this morning. I have my aloe set. I've been obsessed with wearing cute Pilates socks. I got these from a little shop on Instagram called 60%. I'm gonna bring my pink sweater with me. Then I just have my little Gymshark bag. I put a cute bow on it. I'm still putting in some of my workout essentials. I have deodorant, a little snack protein bar. These are my favorites. I have my wallet in here, AirPods. I'm going to be getting into my skincare. I am in a good mood this morning because I woke up early, did all my self-care stuff, I exercised, and I'm telling you, it is scientifically proven that hot girls have productive morning routines. Like, in this last month, I kept telling everyone, why have I been feeling so down these days? But then when I asked myself, have you gone outside today? Did you exercise today? Did you eat three meals? Have you talked to anyone? Did you get off your phone today? And of course, my answer to all of those questions was no. Which made me realize that those were the reasons why I wasn't feeling good about myself and why I wasn't motivated or being productive. It really is all about just making the effort to do the little things that, you know, are going to make you feel good as annoying as it is to hear working on your habits really does make a difference so besides my routine something else that i've been working on is keeping my space clean and working on my apartment i'm actually currently in my second room i don't know if you could see but i'm currently putting together a little beauty room which i'm so excited for i've always wanted to have like a whole setup where i could just get ready and it's gonna be so cute i'm hoping that that'll be a video that comes out in the next few weeks 
I recently got a bunch of new makeup. I kind of just threw it into this bag here. We need to take a moment to appreciate this beautiful pink Fenty highlighter. I also just recently got this new highlighter brush. And this is literally the only highlight I ever use. Like, just look at how good that looks. My favorite gloss. Okay, I have finished getting ready. I am now going to go fix my hair and put on an outfit. Look at how cute this set is. And the little bows. I'm about to have a cleaning session and I'm on my Spotify right now. I've been so addicted to making playlists for every different occasion. Go follow me. I'm about to listen to my girl boss get ready with me. addicted to making myself oatmeal every single morning for breakfast this is my caramel oatmeal recipe it's just so delicious and quick to make i cannot get enough of this I started taking some time to sit at my desk on my computer or on my bed on my laptop to get my life together I'll go over my calendar and just make sure I'm on top of any important things that are coming up I need to get better at adulting that is something that I seriously suck at and it's a part of my life that I feel like I don't really showcase on social media There's quite a few things that are stressing me out like taxes having to deal with my own doctor's appointments and insurance and my car situation Like I'm just a girl Why do I have to deal with these things and just to make things worse sometimes i'll procrastinate on dealing with these things for several weeks several months even and then drive myself crazy having to deal with these things at the very last minute which is not cute so on my laptop right now i just finished organizing my notion page which let me just show you it's super cute since we are approaching the end of april i started planning for the month ahead i also have this list on my notes which you should totally screenshot they're all things that i always plan for at the beginning of each month i need to deal with some really important important things like i'm planning on getting lasik pretty soon for my eyeballs and i need to make some phone calls for that today actually as well as getting a new car because i mentioned in a previous vlog how my car broke down and it was so tragic so in my agenda one of my upcoming vlogs will be me getting a new car and then lastly i actually have a meeting to deal with my taxes wish me luck Last thing I did this morning was go out to run some errands. I had to ship out some packages. so funny i thought i would show you the chaos outside of my apartment whenever i go out to go on walks the city is just so busy at all times but then as soon as i get back home it is perfectly peaceful in my apartment Every morning looks different for me. I would vlog another morning for you. This feels so good. So today's a bit of a busier morning. I have to go out to West Hollywood. I have an event that I'm going to later and also a meeting with one of my managers. And since I'm going to be driving out there today, I thought I would do my work this morning at a coffee shop. Something about me is that I am the most productive when I romanticize doing work. So when I make the effort to go out to a coffee shop, I'm more motivated to actually get my work done, which is so funny. I stopped by community goods right now. I got myself a matcha and a sandwich. 
So this morning ended up being kind of a fail because my laptop ended up dying. I wasn't able to do any work at the coffee shop. I ended up heading to the meeting and event that I had this morning. I wasn't able to vlog much of the meeting, but here is how one of the events went. about to be 12 p.m. right now. I'm back home and I decided I'm going to be spending the rest of my morning in bed editing because I am overstimulated. I did way too much socializing this morning and I feel like I didn't really get to do a lot of my morning routine things like working out for example which I'll do later but you guys I was also sitting here taking a moment to look through my YouTube comments because I love you guys and I read every single one of your comments so if you go comment something I will see it and heart it but I've noticed that so many of you have been complaining that my videos are short and as i'm editing right now this video is about to be around 10 to 12 minutes and i need your opinion go comment if you guys prefer shorter videos that are like 8 to 10 minutes or longer videos that are over 20 minutes because personally i have a short attention span and i feel like i get easily bored of videos that are over 20 minutes like as much as i love yapping i'm scared that you guys will get bored so i try to keep my videos short and i love fast-paced editing editing i just feel like that holds my attention so much more but of course if you guys really want to see longer videos for me and hear me yap some more i will gladly do that i may try that out in my upcoming videos and see how you guys like it but yeah my morning today was pretty crazy i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for your support like i said i love reading your guys's comments going through my dms seeing your guys's messages whenever you tag me in anything i always end up seeing it and loving it so much make sure to follow me on all social media to stay up to date with me i'm gonna be trying to enter my active era on social media because i feel like i've kind of taken a step back for the sake of my mental health but i see your guys's comments and i know that you guys want to see more content from me so this video is your sign as well to get into your productive era start prioritizing your routines especially your morning routine because your morning routine is the most important part of your entire day that is it for this video i love you guys so much and see you next week